hello so welcome to today's video this is the help to one here of course i'm super excited to have you here today so in today's tutorial i'll be teaching you how to remove background from any of your picture and still retain the quality of that picture of course the app we'll be making use of is photo room app this is the app here of course if you don't have it go to your play store or your apple store or even from your opera mini and download it okay remember this app makes use of data so your data must be on for you to be able to use it so when you download it click on it and open it if it's where you're logging in or anything just follow in the details and put in everything that is needed okay so when you open it this is the default of this app okay the first thing i'm going to do is to click on start from photo Okay, you see some of your recent photos here, but the one I want to use is not among the recent photos. I'll click on my gallery. Click on gallery again. Then locate the picture that you want to use. Okay, so this is the picture I want to remove the background. Look at it here. So I will select it. Good. This app will automatically remove the background for you without stress. Good. Hope you are seeing it. Now, when you look at this up part, you see white, black, and transparent. Remember, as a graphic designer, for you to be able to use your picture to design, you need to remove the background. That is the aim of this. So, we are not going to use white or black. We are going to use transparent. Okay? So, click on transparent. Good. Hope you are seeing it. It has removed the background automatically. But another thing I want you to know is that I'm making use of the pro version of this app. So if you are not making use of the pro version of this app, it will show what uh, photo room watermark at the end of this part. So one of the ways you can be able to avoid it affecting your photos is this. Just double click on the picture and move it out from that edge to this place. Sometimes it will take moving it up, okay, to make sure it does not affect the picture you want to use for your design. Then by the time you take in your picture to your pixel app or any app you want to use for the design, you can go ahead and crop out the watermark so that it will not show in your design, okay? Good. So after that, the next thing we're going to do is just to download it and we are done. So click on this download icon on the top right hand here, this icon here. Click on save to gallery. And your image is saved, your photo is saved to your gallery, and you are done. Hope you enjoyed this video. Go ahead and click on the notification icon and subscribe to this channel for more wonderful and educating videos. See you in the next video.